I'm Anthony Green. I'm a singer, I'm a songwriter, and uh, we're going to talk about some stuff today. <laughs> <laughs> I got in trouble with the law a couple times that were, I thought it was really, I think when I look back on it now, uh, uh, it's funny, but um, at the time, both of these incidences were, were really terrifying as like a young person who first started touring. And my first band ever uh, was called Seosin. We were doing a tour uh, with a band I can't, I shouldn't name. What was the name of the band? We were opening for them and we were young and super dumb. And we bought all these fireworks. Like as soon as we got, as soon as we got like, like down, like in a place where we could buy fireworks, we just bought a ton of them. And uh, I couldn't really sleep in the van. I took my contacts out in a little pair of short shorts. I took some night quill. I was in a state of mind, right? Very out of it. The band is like, the other band that we're traveling with, it's opening is like kind of driving across the road from us. And everybody's like, oh, it's, I'm not gonna say who it is. And uh, I was like, oh, okay. I'm gonna shoot fireworks at them. So I grabbed all these Roman candles and we started shooting fireworks at them and just throwing we were going down the road and just hitting them. And the band was like, I remember watching them before the first Roman candle got fired at them from across the road. And they were like, yeah, we were looking at each other and they were like mooning us and everything. And I was like, I started seeing fire and they were like 20 minutes later down the road. We had stopped all this. I think we had run out of. Roman candles, and the cop pulls us over and starts telling us the whole story, and we're just like quiet, playing dumb. I can't even really see anything because my contacts are out, so everything looks like a Van Gogh painting, you know, like it's just like like kind of blurry. And I'm in my shorts, and I'm just quiet. He let us go for some reason. He was like, "All right, well, you know, chill." Somehow we got back on the road, and then five minutes later, got pulled over again by that cop and like four other cops. Get out of the car who was setting fires, who was doing this. Somebody said, and like, I just remember him being like, all right, you're all coming in unless somebody takes accountability. Maybe it was like the NyQuil or, I don't know what it was, but I was trying, I, I thought I'd be a hero. And I was like, all right, I threw a sparkler out the window. Like I thought I could diminish it. And he was like, boom, you. Grab me, handcuffed. Like I'm wearing these tiny shorts. I have no contacts in the guy. I, I can't see I'm getting arrested alone. And the cops are talking to me and I'm all out of it. We're driving what seems like forever back to toward Kansas and we pass this fire. And this fire, to my blurry, intoxicated eyes, just looked, it was 40 acres of But it was massive, it was like a kingdom of flames that I drove past. I go back and, I, and they're booking me into this holding cell station in the middle of wherever. And there, I had long black hair at the time, dyed black hair, just, just dumb emo hair, like gauges. Mm -hmm. Not a cool thing to get go into jail in. Like, not a cool thing. I might as well have been in like roller skates and like <laughs> a tube top. It, it was insane. I got into this cell and I was sitting in there not knowing what's happened. And then they bring this other guy in there who was screaming about wanting to kill his aunt. There, he was covered in pepper spray. I could barely breathe. And I'm in there and I'm like up against the wall and he's telling me I was gonna kill his aunt. And I'm like, God, I mean, God. I got charged with arson for this brush fire, but because these cops didn't search the van and didn't do their like charges dropped or something like I didn't get actually convicted of it. This is the first classic tale where a crime actually happened because a lot of times people get with but they weren't doing anything. Uh, you actually did it. You're actually criminal. Supposedly happened. Yeah. Supposedly. Allegedly. Allegedly. Allegedly happened. Okay, so in my theory, <laughs> some other <laughs> was setting brush fires. I threw a sparkler out the window is all I remember. Hey, thanks for watching me talk about horrible things I did. If you want to watch more people talk about things they did, follow Classic Tales. It's pretty awesome.